What is up guys? I have a five below haul for you today and I actually went to two different five belows. The first one had a different sale than the second one which I thought that they were all going to be the same since it's like the same company. Like that's what would make sense to me. But anyhow, the first one that I went to, I'm going to show you what I got. I also picked up some non-sale items so I'll show those to you too. I'll start out with those actually. So I got this printed rug, which I've gotten a printed rug from Five Below before. Actually, I don't know where it is. Hmm. Um, and I really liked it. So this is the one that I got. It matches my room. So I'm kind of excited about that. Uh, I'm gonna keep this in my little tote for when I update my room. And I'm sorry if you guys can hear my heater. It keeps clicking on and off to the left of me. So. Just bear with me it's actually like freezing in Florida today so I'm trying to like warm my house up as much as I can the next thing that I got was kind of like out of my comfort zone but I thought they'd be cool to have on hand just in case I ever wanted to wear them for like a Halloween costume or something get ready for this holographic <laughs> mermaid pants so up close this is what they look like and I liked the top on them because they weren't just like regular pants they actually have kind of like a higher waisted top that has a double lining on the top I don't know it feels like more secure and more yoga panty pantsy panty um, so I picked these up I need to try them on and make sure they fit because they actually don't have a lot of elastic to them so I'm gonna put the seat over there near that okay so now I'm going to get into the things that I got in the sales section so when we first walked in over by the registers they had all of their Christmas stuff and there was a sign that said two for a dollar and I was like so I wonder if that's like the dollar things are two for a dollar and then it goes up from there but no I was wrong everything was two for a dollar so if it was five dollars originally and you were getting it now it was now 50 cents so I picked up this shirt and it is a cat writing Christmas cookies and then Santa is in an alien ship and it's got like snowflakes and it's on like a spacey background. I just thought it would be cute with some tights around Christmas time. So I grabbed that. Um, Christmas time in Florida is never really cold so it's always good to have short sleeve stuff. I also picked up this Christmas story cookie cutter. Um, because I thought it would be cute to have on hand. Uh, my dad really loves a Christmas story and so I thought if we ever have another like holiday party this would be cute for um, those cookies that Allie and I made for the last holiday party. I also picked up a couple things to put in like my gift giving basket. So I got this and it's called Christmas art. This can go for like kids up to any freaking age but on the back it says it was $8.99 even though it was at five below. Um, it kind of reminds me of a scrapbooking kit um, it's got like a bunch of different pages that has stuff that you can color or decorate and then on the front it's got a colorful stacking pen so these are like those pencils where you just pop them off and then each little hat is the color reference so I thought this was cute even if the person doesn't really like to color or anything there's a bunch of pages in here that remind me of scrapbooking so they could use that too. Multi-purpose book. I picked up, did I only get one of these? No I got two of these because I thought they were really cute. They're National Lampoon's Ugly Sweater Bottle Cover and it says don't hog the nog and it's got like the moose on the front. So I thought this was cute to have on hand. Could go for any like Christmassy activity if you were giving a bottle to somebody it's a cute little dresser upper I also picked up this which is a mug wrap and I thought it was adorable so it's like a little sweater for your mug and then your mug handles go here it just clips around it and it's got like puffy hands and a cute little pocket sweater mug you know you always need it and then I also picked up a holiday word search now the second five below that we went to was a little bit different which is kind of confused me so we walked in and they had a cart right away that said, what did it say? It said 10 items for a dollar. So everything in their cart was only a dime. And I was like, whoa, wait, what? So out of that cart, I ended up getting two Christmas ornaments, one for each of my cousins for next year. So 
one Seminole, and then one Gator. And then I also got two Magnets, and these are also 10 cent each, and they're just the National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation House. So I grabbed those. I also grabbed this, which is a pocket peeker. Um, I'm not sure if this is supposed to be the cat or the dog. I know that they had both. To me, it kind of looks like it could be either. I don't know. Animal unknown pocket peeker. But it just looks like that. I thought it was kind of cute. And this was... So they also had a table that had stuff like the prices put on it. And this one didn't have a price. So I think I ended up getting this for 25 cent. And then I got this, which it's originally $5. Let me peel the stickers off it real quick so they don't like actually get stuck on there and make a nasty residue. So I also picked up this and I just thought it'd be cute to sit like on the coffee table during Christmas, but it's a Christmas storybook, which I never have seen this before. And it says the book that inspired the hilarious classic film. But that was the last thing that I picked up. So I hope you guys enjoy this little haul. And if you have a five below in your area, definitely run out and check and see what they have because stuff is marked down to 25 cent and some a dime. So definitely worth the gas to get there and check it out and see what they have. So you can just hoard for next year or you can get gifts for next year for super cheap, whatever you wanna do with it. And yeah, so I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.